Woods joining us now from Fox Sports News. Very good afternoon to you. Uh, let's start with the cricket. Steve Smith, Dave Warner, no good news for them. They won't have their bands shortened. They won't be back for the summer. Cricket Australia held firm here and the Australian Cricketers Association, which made this plea or this submission on the basis of the long staff report and the guilt going all the way up the chain, uh, is also now satisfied that it's not going to take this any further. It, it doesn't agree with the decision, but it'll cop it on the chin. So it means that Bancroft will be back late December as usual and late March will be the return for Dave Warner and, and Steve Smith. A lot of people thought that this was uh, a bit of leverage used in the rebuilding of the relationship between the Cricketers Association and Cricket Australia, which goes way back to the pay dispute. But um, I, I think they're pretty, both pretty confident, obviously, they can get on without having to come to a compromise over this. There was all sorts of things put forward. There was the shortening of the length of the ban proposed. There was also compromise in terms of, OK, keep the full ban on internationally, but maybe come back and play shield cricket or big bash. But in the end, they've thrown all that out. And I must say, a lot of the feedback, despite the support for this proposal from within the cricket world itself, mainly players and ex-players, a lot of public anger still there. So every time I've mentioned this publicly, we've had a lot of feedback from people saying, no, the ban should stay. Maybe Cricket Australia has sniffed the breeze here.